Good evening, fellow collectors. October 21st, 2008. And tonight is our first installment of looking at some of the Derek Jeter autographs on the Coach's Corner website. Uh, Coach's Corner, of course, labels themselves as the premier sports auction site. So what we're going to be doing uh, every couple days or so is looking at these uh, Coach's Corner premier autographs. And before I continue with this, I will say emphatically that I have absolutely no vested interest when I expose fake autographs on various auction sites, okay? I don't have a hobby store. I'm not a uh, eBay power seller. I don't have an eBay store. I just care about this. There are very few of us who care about this, but we really do care. Uh, the first thing we're going to do tonight is we're going to go to the Coach's Corner website. That would be www.myccsa.com. www.myccsa.com. That'll take you right to the home page. And in the top right hand corner, you'll see a search box. You'll type in Derek Jeter, click on search, and you'll get a listing of all the Derek Jeter autograph items. And I will say that any items that I expose as fakes, as forgeries, will not be questionable items. They will be 100% forgeries. No borderline, no questionable, 100% fake. So let's get started. The first one I want to expose is lot number 258. Uh, you'll see it better on the website, of course. But lot 258 with a COA from Playball Authentics is a 100% forgery. And if you read the item description, it claims that Playball Authentics had a private signing with Derek Jeter. Well, that is an absolute lie. Playball Authentics has never had a private signing with Derek Jeter. As a matter of fact, this particular forgery, and there have been hundreds out there of this one, from Playball Authentics, they are all fakes. There is not one thing from Playball Authentics with Derek Jeter's autograph on it that is authentic. They're all forgeries. As a matter of fact, most of the stuff from Playball Authentics are forgeries. Um, let's go to Lot 223. And 223 I find interesting because not only are they fakes, forgeries, but this particular forgery is on Coach's Corner auction site all the time. Every time they present new listings, this particular forgery is always listed. The original seller has a ton of these out there, almost like an infinite number, and they usually list them in lots of 3, 6, or 12. As a matter of fact, last week they sold 6 of these forgeries, along with 6 forged Alex Rodriguez baseballs, and I will mention that later in part two of this video tonight. Uh, let's go to a lot 569. Now, lot 569 is a stat authenticated certified autographed poster of Derek Jeter. Well, stat authenticated is Coach's Corner, and they supposedly certified this as Derek Jeter's autograph. 100% forgery. There is nothing real about this autograph. Uh, let's go to another one here. Actually, this one here is a dual signed autograph poster of Derek Jeter and Alex Rodriguez. Both autographs are forgeries. The COA comes from a company called Showcase Authentics. And again, like Playboy Authentics, they've been all over eBay. They're all forgeries. Anything with a COA from them with Derek's or Alex's autograph on it is a definite fake. Okay, I usually report them to eBay all the time, and they get removed. All right. Uh, let's go to lot 289. A multi-autograph baseball of Hideki Matsui, Alex Rodriguez, and Derek Jeter. All three autographs are fake. And uh, it's just a, a scribbly mess. Um, uh, what bothers me, aside from the fact that Coach's Corner makes commissions on this garbage, is that I have to wonder who's bidding on this stuff because uh, this is not like these are close autographs. These are 100% forgeries. Okay, let's go to uh, another stat authenticated certified autograph of uh, Derek Jeter and Alex Rodriguez. This one happens to be lot number 463, and uh, uh, both of these autographs are fake. Of course, you'll get a better view on the auction site, but uh, those are two forgeries. Um, here are Here's a guy who... Whoever submitted this one to broker Coach's uh, Corner to sell these just 
scribbled a bunch of circles as Derek Jeter's autograph. It's lot number 567. And uh, both of these Derek Jeter autographs are forgeries. Um, let's go to another obvious forgery. And this is lot number 359. Now, this is an obvious forgery for one obvious reason. I won't tell you that reason right now, but anybody who knows Derek's Jeter autograph in the least knows that this is a fake. Just like uh, lot number 424, this uh, autograph base of Derek Jeter, 100% forgery. Now, I am not going to say this stuff on video like this in public if I wasn't 200% sure that those are forgeries, okay? Uh, I'm going to cut this video right now. We're going to go to part two tonight. In part two, I'm going to expose some of the coach's uh, commode uh, forgeries that sold last week. So I will see you in a few minutes.